dwarf showing shoguns how to quit going in and out of sight. Howdy. Picture this delight, a picture framed us smiling. Hey, all right, a sign that. Yeah, a lot of things just happened. Let me actually refresh my shit so I can see chat again. Okay. I can see chat again. So yeah. Um I don't know what the fuck happened to the internet. I just this this has nothing to do with anything. I went to use the bathroom and I stubbed my fucking toe which I did that like maybe a week and a half ago and I didn't really like look at my toe or anything. I was just like whatever fuck out that hurt. So I live in this goddamn Mickey Mouse Disney kindergarten house. Um and so cool and then one day i woke up and i and i looked at uh like i just felt something on my toe and um i looked and it was like just a like i had this deep cut like deeper than i expected it to be on my toe and i was like oh fuck that's weird I wonder where that came from well i just fucking stubbed my toe in the exact same spot and yeah that's where it came from now that's bleeding again it's bleeding and it looks very scary do you want a snack to help no. Thank you, though. Wait, the word was slow? That's fucking hilarious. Dude, I saw the first uh, scramble go off, and it was uh, intelligent. That was, that was hilarious, because I forgot who did it, but somebody spelled it wrong. Uh, okay, okay, I think, I think we're good, right? Yes. Jesus fucking Christ, what a disaster. Apparently the uh, internet reset for my internet being upgraded uh, happened after it was already upgraded. Go figure. All right. Cool. All right, yeah, 148 versus 70 seems um, better, I would say. And more hydrates? I don't know. I'm just Hydrate your them. body. I'm so fucking upset right now. Nah, it's fine. My toe's fine. It'll live. Can you still wiggle it? You think you have a chance here? Because you took one little fault from rat bag, no less. Yeah, it was well, it was enough to hurt, see, and right now it stings because it's fucking. I think it's all the bleeding. Do you have any but. What we have in store for you, know, you whatever. Brave Walker. You don't, do you? Within these walls, you I don't know, do you have some kind of secret weapon? Terrible seething. No, I don't want to spoil it. <laughs> okay. All our training comes down to this. We're ready. We've taken one fort, then we can take another. This piece Do I get different voice actors it. depending on uh on the orcs that I capture. Oh yeah, the captures again. So, oh, I didn't actually, I wanted to talk about this. This is one of the things, I think this is the thing I was wanting to talk about earlier. Okay, real quick. I mean, this isn't a big fucking thing, but okay. So we have got the internet upgraded, right? So I, the first thing I thought was, I can now stream at 1080p. You know, that'd be fucking great. And because we can just handle it, it's no problem now. And so I looked it up and apparently um, as a Twitch affiliate, not partner because partners are just, they get everything. Um, but as a Twitch partner, um, 
you get different stream options on your stream. That's just, you know, part of it. But as an affiliate, you don't get stream options. So basically, if somebody connects and their internet, their internet isn't very good, but enough, you know, good enough to like watch at 720, basically, um, then they would be, they might be forced at 1080. So because sometimes I get quality options and other times I don't, depending on uh, Twitch's, uh, I, I guess that's how they, they, they seem to dole out server space randomly, depending on how many people or how many partners are streaming at the time or something. I do get them sometimes as an affiliate. Yeah, exactly, Dark. So. Yeah. That, uh, that I wanted to stream at 1080. I really did, but uh, I, I don't think I should risk it. But wouldn't, wait, so explain this one to me, Dark. Somebody wants to watch a stream at, you know, um, 240 or, you know, 480 or something like that. Doesn't it take them less infrastructure usage to allow somebody to watch it at a lower resolution? Yeah, but it's also a fucking site that's literally backed by Amazon and is the biggest streaming service. You would think they'd be able to make it so that at least affiliates are able to use, you know, always have quality options, but fuck me, I guess. I guess it's really only one of those things that you complain about until you get partner, and then after that you don't care anymore. That's not a shot at you, Dark, at all. I Sorry, that sounded like, that sounded like I was just bitching about you, but no, no, I... I don't know, I just... Sometimes Twitch pisses me off. That sounded really petty. I, it was not directed at you at all. God. Dude, this execution thing was the best thing, the best skill to get. Oh, sorry. Um, oh, they're providing the stream at all of those quality options. Yeah, I guess that does make sense, actually. That actually does make a lot more sense. Start the stream with no transcoding options. You can stop and restart and immediately have them. Oh. I actually didn't know that either. There's a lot of Twitch things I just don't fucking know. God damn, this turned into a clusterfuck fast. These point capture things are kind of fucking, like, I like them, but they're also really kind of weird to see because when I think of, like, point capture stuff, I usually think of, like, FPSs. Also, 1080p, even at the highest bitrate, is still very low for what the resolution needs. For what that resolution needs. Yeah. Yeah, I read, isn't like, um, like 5,000 the max on Twitch usually? Change your encoding reset to be slow to get close. Need around 10 to 12k bitrate. Interesting. Interesting. I could probably pull that off with my rig, but at this point, it's not very well worth it for me personally to, uh, you know, as an as an affiliate to care about, I guess. Oh, 
But maybe eventually, maybe one day, to get lucky and my internet doesn't disconnect when I have a bunch of people watching. That'd be cool. I really do despise myself for wanting partners sometimes. Like, it's not that I'm just unhappy with streaming or anything like that. It's just one of those things that's like just extra pressure on me to get and play the right games and and do the right things to get that partner. <laughs> so, I don't know. It's fucking annoying to me that I'm, I'm, you know, wanting it that badly, I guess. Would I actually go into this place? No, I don't think it's a crime for wanting it either. It just makes that much... It makes little things affect me that much more. Like, my internet just reset. For some reason, God knows why. And, you know, I went from, like, 65-ish viewers to 40. And 40 is still good for me. That's great. But, like, you know, it's just one of those things where it's like, you lost 25 viewers because your internet reset. That fucking sucks, man. And it just hurts you more when you're trying to go for that magic number over and over again every fucking stream. <laughs> Oh, I love a good challenge. This no, guy is fucking cool. I like him. No <laughs> Need those perk upgrades, me. yes, exactly. Let's get on with it. Well, you're Good just luck. counting you're counting on everything going correctly. And sometimes things just don't go correctly, you know? That's, that's lift for you. Oh wait, I got one of those crazy counters that I couldn't counter before, but this time I was able to? Where are my boys? This is a fuck, this is gonna be a fight and a half, actually. I didn't think it was gonna be this, this uh, intense. I thought my boys were always gonna be with me, but apparently not. Oh, I got him through the stomach, though. Nice. Great, he adapted to stun, which is my least favorite thing for somebody to adapt to. Okay, interesting. So the Y button actually makes me jump back. Jesus fucking Christ, dude. Oh, I need some... Some boy. I need some boy in me. Good. Oh, never mind. But didn't start back in 2014. Yeah, I guess it just... It's one of those things that take a while. It's one of those things that take a while. I don't know, it's just... Like, I, I feel almost, like, spoiled, right? Because, like, I have my YouTube channel, and that's that's the thing I care about the most. This is just, it's just a bonus for me. It's one of those things that I also want to have a successful Twitch channel. Cool. But, like, it, I almost feel like it's asking for too much at some, you know, at times, I guess. And I honestly think it should just be more, like, my intention with it, 
committing to Twitch as much as I can and actually making a schedule, sticking to it, etc., etc., is just because I know that there are people in my community that really like that. They really like that I stream. And that's fucking cool. I'm, I'm down to do that. And that's how it started, but then it turned into this thing where it's like, oh, you know, I bet you I could eventually get partner. And now it's like one of those things where it's like, well, you know, today's viewership isn't as good. Well, I wonder why that is. Maybe it's because I streamed this game. Maybe it's because I didn't say something right, you know, whatever, you know. All the little things that come with fucking questioning your self-worth as a content creator. Oh, God, dude. Oh, I'm fucking dead. Ugh. That sucks. I'll let my boys play with your corpse while it's warm, but when it gets cold and stiff, it's all mine. <laughs> yeah. 100% dark. I get that. I wish. I wish I didn't start streaming until, uh. I wish I didn't start streaming until I uh, got, like, to around where I'm at now. Because, um, when I first started my channel, and uh, I had my initial burst of success, I started streaming on uh, YouTube, and then I decided to move over to Twitch because I didn't like how YouTube system was set up for streaming. But I feel like if I got to a point like where I'm at now, and I started streaming on YouTube, that I... It, people wouldn't care as much that I streamed on it. Um, I'm still not necessarily a big fan of that, but at this point I put, there's so many videos out there where I go, hey, I, um, we will go on until you know, I stream on Twitch. Here's my Twitch channel. So it seems kind of silly to even, you know, like I put a lot of fucking effort into directing people towards this now. I don't want you. I want the fucking worm. Oh, wait, I guess I could do this. Just keep having bets. I'm working out of bed. Yeah, I think as long as you have a schedule, it's it's not the daily so much as the, as it is the schedule of it. Oh, I mean, don't even worry about that, Mon. I'm, I'm not holding, like, I'll, I'll never be one of these people that are like, I can't believe you didn't watch me today. Where were you during the stream? Like, uh, you know, I don't, like, fucking that's ridiculous. That is, I don't even watch streams that often. Like, you could ask Dark. I think I watch Dark the most out of everyone that I watch on Twitch currently. I watch Dark the most, and I barely fuck it. I, even then, he'll, I'll barely pop into his streams. Like, I just don't watch streams very much. Um, but I totally get, you know, some people jump around between streams. Some people are only interested in certain games, you know. You know, it is it is what it is. I'm never going to hold that against anyone. Um, it's just one of those things where... Like, building up a Twitch audience is a lot harder than you think it would be, especially because it's like, so I got 300,000 people on YouTube and I direct everybody to my Twitch streams and now I have, I think like 6,500 followers or something, but it's like, I'm still, you know, struggling to get to that 75 mark for partner. And it's like, that's because of A, I stream for four hours and depending on which time zone I'm in, like I, I'm, I'm very... Like, I stream pretty late for Europe on a weekday, and I stream pretty early for for the U.S. on a weekday, or, you know, North America in general. So, like, I just stream at a weird fucking time. That might be a huge part of it. I don't know for sure, and I won't know for sure until I get back to the U.S. You know? Shit just happens. There's a lot of little factors that I'm not entirely sure, you know? 
is exactly what's fucking me over or whatever. And I try not to be new, too negative about it. But sometimes it gets to me. It is what it is. Small streams are definitely more pleasant in general. Once once a stream starts to become a hive mind of just like scrolling chat and it's like, ah, you know, like I look over a chat and it's just everybody's just fucking typing and I can't read anything. Like, I don't want that. I just want partner. I literally, I want this little, this little, like, title. I just want this title. Uh, hey, I'm also a Twitch partner. That's fucking cool. There's no reason for it. I don't... It's just like a, like a point of pride or something. I don't know. It's just something I want. It's really stupid. And that's and that's why I feel stupid for kicking myself sometimes about shit like this. Oh, Thanks, Bison. Yeah, yeah. It's 1 a.m. for me. So, you know, just I just I just stream at a weird go. fucking time for multiple uh, so multiple major time zones. I've, hey, I've, you got a new follower. Thank you for following. Yeah, anytime. I said that I stream for, I stream at the perfect time for the Atlantic Ocean. Did I have an amount of time? No, I just want it. <laughs> Doesn't matter when I get it. I guess, I guess the thing that it started to bother me more because um, there was a time where when I was streaming in the beginning when I first started my uh, schedule in December, my average view count was probably around like 25. And then it started to go up a little more. You know, it started to get to 30 around January, 35 in February, and then 40. And then like it started to go up and up and I was really fucking excited about that. And then I had this, uh, I think last month, I just went down and i was like is it the games i'm playing like what's going on like i was trying to figure it out like i don't know why i'm stressing about it i really don't like i don't need to be a partner it's just something i want oh i believe you there's got to be a lot of fucking people that are on the partner grind Okay, wait, hold on. I think I can stun this guy. Yes. Oh, I almost... Almost got it. Do these archers, though. Dude, these archers are fucking just destroying me. Where are these fucking- oh, they're up there. Oh, I can actually do this. Actually, even better. As long as they miss, I can do that. And then I've got my own march, my own marchers. <laughs> no, you are not. Sud I'm not. We're not suddenly rich if I make partner. In fact, it would be pretty much the exact same thing as now, except I'd have a partner badge, which is fucking cool. I just want the badge. It's fucking annoying. It's annoying that I, I let it get that much in my head. Yeah, no, I, I agree with you, Ajax. It's just, it's hard to like, when you give it your best and it's like, oh, I'm trying my best. Why isn't success just falling into my lap? It's like, <laughs> I don't know, because you're already successful on YouTube. Why don't you just take that and fucking be okay with it? No, yeah, no, after that, it's not like, you know, 
everything is the lap of luxury now. You 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 have completely won, dude. Oh my god. I have to press Y. I cannot dodge during that. I tried to dodge during that, and he just wouldn't let me. He refused. Let's see if there's more archers up here for me to just eat. Oh, shit. Come on. Like, I obviously want this guy. It does change a lot. Now I've got archers fighting for me, which is really cool. Oh, are you just now? Talk. Maybe we'll share a last breath. <laughs> yeah, that's true. I do like that I'm able to stream pretty much anything I want. I mean, some things aren't as successful for sure, or popular, but you know, that's bound to be the case with fucking anybody. That's not a that's not a me problem. That's just a you know a general issue that anybody would have. You can't just stream whatever the fuck you want at all times, but, like, I can do a lot of things that a lot of other people couldn't do. I wonder if he can get over having a soft head if I can nail him enough. I fucking hate these shield guys so much. I gotta, I gotta take out the shield guy. Or even better, I can just... What? Oh, shit. Don't kill me. Oh, he almost did. Oh, no, I am dead. Okay, great. I didn't know he could just instant kill me from literally full health, but I'll keep that in mind next time. Whatever will I do with you now? <laughs> God damn it, not Jake. Oh my God, dude. Okay, last try. Then I'm fucking late. Hey, you got a new follower. Thank you for following. Yeah, anytime. Do you think of your family, Keller Brimble? Of the life you had? There was a time when I thought of them every day. That was a long time ago. <laughs> Yo, thanks, Brandon. Appreciate that, dude. three <laughs> see Brandon knows the reason I'm not bringing a bodyguard I thought they'd just follow me in if they don't follow me in then I don't want them they're not loyal enough you once already, and now you and your friends want to move in well let's see whether you're worthy Hey, someone sub to you. <laughs> Thanks, Gauss. Yeah, no problem. I didn't know that you could summon them in the room afterwards. I thought they'd follow me. All right, first things first, I want my archers. Yeah, I'd probably make things a little easier, though. Do I have to activate these guys, or they just go, right? The bright master was within you. 
Uh, maybe, maybe I did have to activate them. I don't know what to do with it. Well, now you have access to my emotes. And with those, you can emote at people. It's great. And every time you use one of my emotes, I get money. No, that's not true. That would be fucking insane, though. Actually, you know, I'll take you too if I can. I apparently, there's another archer here. Oh no, I got hit with my own guy. Cool, thank you. The one time I fucking get my own guy here with me, and he fucking hits me in the back when I'm converting someone. So that's grand. Alright, third time's the charm. I like that this guy's been over here the whole time. Ah, oh, great, another one. You think any parents named their kid Celebrimbor? God, I hope not. Hey, you got a new follower. Yo, thanks for following. Yeah, anytime. Oh, thank God that curse got me. I like how he adapted the first time. To me, um... Oh my fucking God, it's the instant kill again. Which is really fucking stupid. Oh, no, I guess this one didn't do it that time. I should be able to get this guy this time. Oh, hello? That works. <laughs> kind of. Not exactly what I thought was going to happen, but... I can't convert him, so... Jesus. Won't you? Water it with blood. Make sure it I feel a little I feel a little bad for this hey, guy. Hey, you got a new follower. I... Thank you for following. Yeah, anytime. He was a cool boy. What's the hard C? Hunt? Oh, oh, Celebrimbor, right. If you listen, you can hear the so what's up, Caligula? How's it going? As they uh, I'm about done streaming, but, you know, victory, what's up? How's it going? Again. He didn't answer fast enough the first time, so I thought I'd ask again. Yeah. 
I accept that answer. It's, that's a good answer. Does it matter if I upgrade my fucking port? That's only for online play, right? I guess I could upgrade the shit out of this one. Oh, who's gonna be my overlord? Alright, you guys figure this out. We got Norsco Cannibal. That's a classic choice right there. Nobody would be disappointed with Norsco Cannibal. Then we got uh, Archaeus Pain Seeker. Uh, the poisonous terror destroyer who is very weak to poison. We have Push Crimp. That's my boy. That's my bodyguard. Push Crimp the Wasteful Hunter. Uh, Flog the Unashamed. Now he is a legendary terror beastmaster. And his name is Flog. Can't go wrong. And then we got Zugor Blood Mad. I don't know what that means, but he is he's got mad blood, dude. Also legendary poisonous mystic assassin. What do you guys got? Uh, Push Crimp definitely earned it for a bit. I mean, Cannibal. I got two for Flog, two for Flog, all right. But he said Zugor. Yeah, Zugor, I mean, that's, that's those are some good words in his name. And he's unashamed. Oh, uh, fucking, who do you, uh, mod for? If I mean, if you want to reveal that, I don't give a shit. You don't have to. Alright, yeah, we're going flog. I, TA5ES, for some reason I just, my brain re-scrambled those into the Elder Scrolls 5. <laughs> I'm guessing it's tases. Maybe not. Yeah, Flog, Flog, you're a good boy. Not ashamed at all. What's up, Wem? Okay. We are good. And I got armor. Purple armor at that. Fuck yeah, brother. That's two purple items. That means I got a set bonus. Which is really god dang cool. Uh, let's do that. Right on. Couple small WoW streamers. Are there? I mean, fucking. That's way more viewers than I have. <laughs> oh Jesus. That's cool though. That's. I mean, it. That's the best. The best time to be a mod is when you have, you know, a community that isn't complete asshole. <laughs> a little. Just a tiny, baby little community of 500 to 600 viewers. Jesus fucking Christ. Thanks, Dick. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. Uh, I like the 10% increased damage, but I also like 7.5% XP earned, which is like, you know. That's solid, man. I don't know. Um... So it's only on armor that the XP earn is a thing, though. Hmm. No set bonus? Oh, wait, there are they are different sets. Hold on, hold on. How do I look at that? Track challenge? No. View gear? There's, like, a way to actually, like, look at the, uh, like, the set bonuses and shit, but I don't quite understand. These are the machine people, and these are the mystic people, and this is the warmonger people, so I guess not. I just like that they were purple. I thought because they were purple, they were the same fucking people. Okay, yeah, so everything's all mismatched. Uh, 
Oh, yeah, it is at the bottom. I thought there was, like, a different menu for that, but I guess not. Color's just rarity. Yeah, it seems to be. Seems to be the case. Yo, thanks, Iliavi. What's up, dude? Were you here earlier, or am I just making that up? Am I going fucking crazy? Upgrade seemed decent. Yeah, dominated grunts take 50% less damage. I know, but I need another mystic set, dude. Which I don't think I have at all. Uh, this is a... Dark. Yeah. None of my sets sync up. Dude, you got a new follower. Yo, thanks for following. Alright. Cool. Wait. I have a sword? Oh, that's, yeah, that's literally what I just equipped. I'm dumb. Uh, ooh, two skill points. Fucking nut. Alright, uh, let's go for that Wraith Chain, finally. Yeah, that's fucking solid. I like Wraith Chain. And I'm actually tempted to go for, uh... Yeah, kill con first kill consumes no focus. That's great. And then we'll go for the range shit after that. Although Deadly Spectre is also... Yeah. Solid. Look at the cloak. Uh, uh, okay, I'll pretend like I remember where that is. Inventory. I know I can upgrade this cloak, but it's a dark cloak, so it doesn't actually... It still doesn't sync with any set. I mean, I... You know. Oh, wait. Upgrade. I have to... I have to do the challenge to upgrade it. It won't let me upgrade it until... Until I complete the challenge. Oh, the yellow one? 50% uh, increased damage dealt by beast allies. Is that... I like 24% less damage from ranged attacks. I have to execute an archer real quick. Hold on. Let me see if I can find an archer so I can do that real quick. That's I like my cloak better. Also, oh, it was Garrison. That's what it was. No, it wasn't Garrison. How do I upgrade my shit? I thought it was Garrison, but then it wasn't. I want to upgrade my boys. Uh, oh. Oh, it was over here. That's what it was. It was on this side instead. Okay. Do I care about this? Is this a, does this really matter? I mean, I don't know what else I would really spend money on, but... Only if your fort's attacked. Is the, that's only an online thing, right? <laughs> Dude, the Final Fantasy fourteen video might happen someday. I know I could raise the level of my gear to my level, but like... I guess I'm not worried about it yet, I don't know. I'm just gonna upgrade like little things, stone walls, fire spouts. Yeah, sure. I have a little defender host going. Like I don't need to go max upgrades, but like you know enough to it where it's like yeah, cool. Yeah, that's fine. That's looking good. 
I'll have a heads up before they attack me. Okay, good. Well, whatever. I got the little upgrades for now. Look at this guy. What the fuck emote is that and why? Is that a bay leaf? Or a chikorita? I wish I wish that didn't exist. Like I just wish that wasn't a, a thing that I witnessed with my own eye. Huh. Yeah, no, I, I feel like a less I feel lesser for seeing that. Or have seen the or have seen that. <laughs> Are you fucking Okay, you know what? I need animated emotes. Have they let everybody do that yet, or is it only specific people still? What was I doing? Oh, I went to execute an archer, so I'm just gonna go roam until I find one real quick. Hey, you got a new follower. Thank you for following. Yeah, anytime. Yeah, I, I think that's probably the reason why you were gifted those. Because of your name there, bud. Alright, if I were an archer, I'd probably be somewhere high. Let me ask you this, uh, Caligula, love, since you, I mean, you don't have to go into this, I guess it's just kind of conversation, but, um, since you didn't reveal, since you didn't name your people, I think this would be okay to talk about, maybe? But, uh, how do they feel, or do the general people in your, your WoW communities that you mod for, uh, feel about the whole, um, the idea that, that Final Fantasy XIV is going to kill them, kill off WoW, not kill them personally, but you know what I mean? Like, that's, that's the big rumor right now, is that it will now die. WoW will now die to uh, Final Fantasy XIV. Oh, I can't assassinate that yet. Oh, it says execute, right? So, I think that works. Yeah. Oh, I 100% I agree with that, Bison. Especially with the way that uh, Blizzard's been running WoW, even before, the, even before all the controversy. Oh, well, never mind then, Caligula. You do not have to to engage me in conversation <laughs> I explicitly after you said that you were going to leave. My bad, dude. I didn't see that. Uh, let's see, inventory. Is that the only challenge on it? Oh, I actually hit the upgrade. Solid. I, I don't really need to upgrade anything else, but I guess it doesn't... Oh, I have to do the challenges still. Reuse a ranged weapon to kill a frozen enemy? Okay. Pretty live and let live. Final Fantasy XIV doesn't float either of their boats. That's cool. I mean, yeah, no, I'm, I'm good with that. I guess I just... I guess I was kind of wondering if they actually felt it was going to, but I, they probably don't. <laughs> Just curious is all, I guess. I can actually upgrade this one. 50% increased damage dealt by allies to poison enemies. 15 might gain per enemy drained. That's actually kind of nicer. Let's do that one. I only upgraded it to 24? Weird. I wonder why. Hmm. Where death equals delete. Oh, that's fucking cool. So they're like they're like Iron Man players for for a while though. Uh, I, the thing is, WoW's been too big to fail for a while, but I think the more that the more things mount against them, the 
better chance they actually do have of imploding. Like, people have been complaining about WoW's balancing, uh, at least not, like, WoW Classic's a whole other can of worms, but, like, first of all, the way that devs have responded to the player community and stuff like that, and, and second of all, how a lot of people describe WoW, which I haven't played since Mists, so I don't know how accurate this is, but a lot of people seem to describe WoW as uh, being against, like, they're working against its own players actively. Like, it hates its own players, almost, with the way that it makes people do things, and the way that it treats their players, um, just with a bunch of different changes and stuff like that, that keep happening over and over again. Um, again, I don't know exactly how true that is, uh, but um, it's just from what I've heard, I guess. Oh, wait, you're a person. I wasn't expecting a real person to be here. Yeah, I, I heard that as particularly in um, in BFA and and partially Shadowlands, yeah, that um, things just kind of got worse and worse for like, you know, respecting people's time. I'm I'm really glad that I stopped playing after Mists because I could easily see myself being in that. You slaughter countless orcs, yet you're unable to finish. How are you alive? Is this because you want me to live with my shame? You're a monster! <laughs> Tactical madman, yeah. That is true. He just tried to bear trap me while I watched him set down the bear trap. You know, I don't even think I can recruit you, so I might actually have to try to kill you again. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to be able to get this guy. He's a little over-leveled for me. Oh! I guess I'll do that instead. Oh, shit! That's fair. That's fair. I am not the boss of you. Then we shall fight to the death. Have at you. Finish me! I can't stand the shame! End it! You might want to, like, slice his head off. Or his arms. No, I, I feel like he could probably still live through that. I hope he does. This one was trying to be subtle. What? When? Mordor's assassins. When was he trying to be subtle? At what stage was any of that subtle? I hope he lives, too. I hope he comes back with metal arms. Uh, don't know about Blizzard, but, uh, um, so there's this whole issue back, like, I don't know, I can't remember when it was, I feel like it was a year ago now? I don't know. Uh, there was this whole issue with, um, some, uh, uh, professional, professional Hearthstone player for, uh, who was, uh, Chinese standing up for Hong Kong and saying, like, free Hong Kong or something like that when that whole debacle was going on. And uh, Blizzard banned him from 
uh, just just for saying that shit. And so a bunch of people like got real upset with Blizzard, and they kind of refused to apologize. And then eventually it just kind of blew over and people forgot about it. So, I don't know. I guess there's that much going for it. Kill an enemy while cursed. Okay. Oh. I still haven't done that. I was trying to do that the whole time. And then this guy snuck up on me. And then another guy snuck up on me. Yeah, Blitz Chung. Yep. I should probably just watch that guy's corpse to make sure he doesn't get back up, but I guess I don't really care. Which is probably why he's gonna get back up. Cool. Oh. That should be upgraded. I mean, from a business perspective, yeah, that's, yep, that's what they were going for, which worked out for them, I guess, but I don't know. All right. I think I'm good. I think I'm good for today. I think I'm good for today. Only Disney went as far as to basically film across the street from one of the internment camps and thanked the security company running them in the credit. Jesus Christ. I had not heard of that. Jesus Christ. Ugh. All right, so yeah, uh, I will be back on Friday. I'm just going to keep playing this fucking game because people seem to be interested in it, and that's cool for me because I'm interested in it. I'm having fun killing orcs and shit. Good time. Um, so yeah, I'll be back on Friday with that. I'm going to do some spins here. Oh, don't worry about it, butt charity. Seriously, don't. Don't even worry about it, dude. You more than, uh, you more than made up for it by posting that emote yeah yeah it's good to see you Caligula glad you dropped by oh wait you already did that well there it is again twice actually you know what just do it a third time whenever you get off cooldown you have a nice night as well if you're taking off and see you Friday but for now for the people sticking around to see what kind of cool fun prizes we're giving out boy let me tell you they're exciting things on this wheel. Probably. Uh, let's see. I just forgot where I put everything on my computer. I just opened a bunch of different folders and none of them were right. But I finally figured out the right one. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go. Let's see, who do we got? Looks like UK and Eldrin. All right. I know. Next time, Caligulove. Next time. Uh, okay, let's do this. <laughs> Jesus Christ, but charity. All right, UK, you're up. And cake apparently is coming up. Wait, what the fuck are you doing? I'll give you any of these. You're my wife. Unless you're giving them to someone. All right, Peaky Blinders Mastermind for UK. For Caligulove. Okay, cool. You can transfer that. Eldrin, you are up. Iron Fisticle. That sounds fun. All right, Caligulove. There you go. Trine 4. The Nightmare Prince. Yeah. Alright, respin for UK. Ah, 
<laughs> Bee simulator, dude. Thanks, Ashes. <laughs> that sounds fucking dope. You never played Trine? Well, now you get to play the fourth one. If you want it. Which you do. Uh, so yeah, UK was, is that alright with you? Um, because of the whole fucking, uh, issue with the key networking for Saints Row 4? Is that, are you good with that? Because, just wanted to make sure. Alright, cool, just making sure. I don't know if you were, you know, really wanted that or not. Well, I guess you did, but, you know. I didn't know how badly. Anyways. So, yeah, I'll be back on Friday. Same, about the same time as always. I'll hopefully have started to play Fable 2 by then. I'll let you guys know that, though. And, uh, yeah. I will catch you then. Thanks for coming out. Thanks for the subs and the follows and the... the... Somebody get bits? I'll pretend like somebody did, if they did. For the bits, and, uh, yeah. What time do I normally start? Uh... Like four hours before this time right now. Whatever time zone you're in. Uh, usually, I start at the earliest around 2.30 p.m. Eastern. And at the latest, I start around 4, 4.30 p.m. Eastern. But I usually stream for like four hours exactly every time. So Usually from 2.30 to 6.30 or like 4 to uh, 8 kind of thing. Eastern. Anyways, catch you guys next time. Goodbye.